Back in 2012, a certain book caught my eye as I was walking through chapters. Do 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 That is the Doctor Who theme song, and I don't know what I'm doing, but it was Unspoken by Sirius Brennan. Oh man, I am here today to talk about my love for Sarah Reese Brennan. So, Sarah Reese Brennan just came out with a new book, Tell the Wind and Fire, which I've been waiting for for like two years and I'm so excited that I have it, oh my gosh. Sarah is one of my favorite authors and I've talked about her in my autobi author video because she is definitely on that list and will be forever. She is so sassy and witty and hilarious and her characters are wonderful and I've read all of her books and will continue to read all of them till the end of time because she's amazing and when I read Unspoken I devoured that book in like one night. It was so great and I told my best friend about it so she read the book and she loved it and then we were waiting for the second one and of course there had to be a cover change even though the first book had a great cover and it was this which is which is fine it just means that my books clash on the shelf especially with the last book I mean it's not the most attractive looking bunch in hardcover I mean you can't get the new cover for book one in hardcover but this series is one of my favorites ever it's so good I love the main character Cammy. she's like an aspiring journalist she's kind of like I guess a female sort of like Sherlock Holmes kind of wannabe. She kind of reminds me of Nancy Drew a little bit, but you know, more feminist. <laughs> and all the characters are so funny. And Jared's like your typical masculine like hench guy, but he's also great. And Ash is, I don't like Ash very much. And just all of the Lindburns are great. And I just love the Lindbergh Legacy so much and I cannot recommend it enough. Which is why I'm making this video about how much I love Sarah Reese Brennan because after I read these I had to pick up her other trilogy which is the Demon's Lexicon trilogy. I only own the last book of it because for some reason this is the only one they had in chapters and they haven't ordered any other ones in. Don't know why but this series is so good as well. If you like demons, if you like magic, read this. Actually, if you like magic, read the other one too. Sarah just writes some great books. Ah, she's great. Which is why I was so excited for like two years after she announced that she was writing Tell the Wind and Fire, which is like a retelling sort of of A Tale of Two Cities by Charles Dickens. And I think it's great. And I love, I love Sarah so much. You know how much I love Sarah? So much that I've been doing things that I wouldn't normally do just to give that promo. Let's cut to the clip of me giving that promo and see how well that goes. So I've been doing this thing for a couple days where I've been like calling people, not my friends or anything, just some random people because I want everyone to read her books. So I thought I'd show you how I do it so maybe you can or whatever. So let's just do a couple right now. Alright, let's just type in a random number onto my phone. All right, and it's dialing. Hello? Hi, have you heard of Sarah Reese Brennan? Um, I'm sorry, who is this? That doesn't matter. Have you heard of Sarah Reese Brennan? She's an amazing author. She's so funny and witty and sassy, and I really think you should read her books. Yeah, I, I have no idea who you are, so I'm, I'm just going to hang up. Uh, but uh, you, you need to read her books. Just go to chapters and, and read her books. She's, she's great. She's great. Hello? Okay, um, so that wasn't successful. I, I, let's try another one, okay? Let's just try another one. Right? Okay, it's dialing. Hello? Hi, have you heard of Sarah Reese Brennan? Uh, no, who is this? That doesn't matter. She's a great author. She's funny and sarcastic and witty and she's got the best books. They hung up on me. Right. So, I mean... I, I, I mean, it's, it's, it, it's gone better 
sometimes. Sometimes people listen and I mean most of the time they don't, but you know, I mean like I said it could have gone better. It, it has gone better. Sometimes I stand by her section in chapters and I tell people to read her books. Sometimes they actually listen. So, you know. And I'm not just making this video because I want to spread promo about her. I just think she's really underrated on booktube. I haven't seen many booktubers talk about her books. And I really want more booktubers to do that because she's amazing. And I feel like more people should appreciate her. I mean, it could be that I'm not just searching hard enough for enough booktubers who love her like I do. But I just wanted to make a video about my love for her. And I guess this is sort of like a weird author talk or author recommendation video, but I just love her so much, like I've said through this whole thing. And I'm so excited for anything else she puts out. And please check her out if you haven't already, you won't regret it. And I guess I should probably mention that this isn't sponsored by anyone, it's just me being a crazy fangirl, because that's what I am. And I'm proud of it. So thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Give it a thumbs up if you did. I'll have some links in the description that you can check out and I highly recommend that you do. And you can subscribe if you want to see more content from me. And I hope you're having a wonderful day. And I'll see you soon in my next video. Bye!